In this video, I would briefly like to talk about the FreshBooks mobile app available for the iPhone and iPad. I'm starting off here where I left off in the last video at the FreshBooks add-ons section. You can access that by going to My Account, FreshBooks API, and then third-party software. But if you're going to start using this app, you can just go to the App Store on your iPhone or your iPad and you can search for FreshBooks. And I'm just going to click on this link down here underneath mobile where it says the official FreshBooks app for the iPhone and iPad because it's just going to give us a little bit more information. But as I mentioned, if you search in the App Store, you'll find the FreshBooks app. And I think it works great. I've used it a bunch. You can add expenses on the fly. So if you're at a business meeting and you need to add a receipt, you can quickly on your phone just enter the amount of the receipt. And then you can actually take a picture of it for auditing purposes. You can take a picture of it right in the restaurant, upload it to your FreshBooks account, and you've got your expense tracked. At the same time, you can also add invoices. So I've actually invoiced clients before leaving their building just by accessing FreshBooks on my mobile phone and then go ahead and creating an invoice or turning an estimate into an invoice right from my phone. So it's definitely a great feature if you're using FreshBooks and if you have an iPhone or iPad. Unfortunately, they don't have an app for Android devices yet, but hopefully that will come in the near future. Um, so you can go ahead and you can check out this video if you want. But like I said, you might as well just search for it on your in the App Store on your phone or iPad and just check it out. You know, try it out and see if you like it. If you're not getting the value out of it, then you don't have to use it. But it's definitely a great feature of FreshBooks and it's very, very user friendly, very simple, easy to use. The only aspect of it that I wish was a little better is the reporting aspect. On the mobile f version, you don't get the access to all the reports you get on the desktop version yet. Uh, it'll actually take you online to the desktop version through the mobile app and you've got to re-log in and that sort of thing and then you can see those reports so hopefully in the near future they'll add some enhanced reporting capabilities in the mobile version but for now it's definitely uh, better than not having a mobile app at all because it just streamlines how quick you can add expenses and you can invoice your clients.